Hi everyone, I'm Coach Medai. Today is about acting. Coach Medai, enjoy acting. Cut. Today's theme is about don't rush. Don't rush. When you do performance in front of the people, in front of the audience, please don't rush. For example, you, when you take audition, you, you do some acting or you, you do some performance in front of the cameraman or the other staff or director. Or, yeah, of course, when you do an acting job, you, you have a lot of audience around you and you have to do some performance. In that situation, at that time, please be careful about this Z. Don't rush. Left side is a black word. is a, is a little bit worst bad situation. Yeah, everyone are very easy to get into this kind of bad situation. Okay, and the right side red word and the blue word is uh, today's conclusion. You should try to do red words. The first of all, I want to share with you about the left side, black words. When people doing performance in front of the audience, people are very easy to get into this situation. A lot of people feel that afraid of the silence, okay? Because a lot of audience see me, watching, watching. So most of the people try to tend to do something, show off something. Yeah, be, be rushed. Oh, I have to do something. I have to next, I have to do, do something. And I, uh, I also want to wanna show off something. Be rushed and at that time most of the people are only thinking about themselves myself can I have a very good evaluation from the director when they are when the audience watching me is my acting good looks good always thinking myself and I start to show off something show off and I do something all the time because they are very afraid of silence if you don't say something you don't do something you feel a little bit awkward this is a bad state so today's point is when you act in front of the audience in front of the director in front of the cameraman in front of the, the other staff it's okay. Don't rush. Don't rush. If you don't say something, it's okay. It is one of your performance. Silence is good for your performance. You have to change your mindset. And please put your focus onto the external things. Please don't focus on myself all the time. Please forget, forget yourself. That's a key point. Please forget about yourself. Please forget your evaluation from the others. Please put your consciousness, please put your focus onto the external things around you. If you work, if you work with the other actors, please focus on the others. Please listen to the other's voice carefully. Please feel the opponent's face expression, emotion, the movement. Please feel the details of the opponent. Please don't always think about yourself. And if you do a performance alone, it's okay. Please feel the area around you. 
if you act like uh, okay, walk, walking in the park outside and very comfortable outside, please feel the wind of the outside. Please try to feel the wind. Please try to hear the voice sounds outside. For example, do you have a do you have a car car sound or a little uh, very small birds singing singing sounds? Or if there is a wind, um, do you hear some some sounds of trees? shaking or please look at the, the other side see is the weather is very good what do you see in front of you or if there is a there's no saying about your acting yeah you know, it's it's very simple it's just you 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 feel the the, the, the praise of audition Please focus on hearing some sounds in the audition place. Or please see the other areas, the, the, the room, very carefully. Okay, the point is, please put your consciousness onto the other stuff, outside stuff. Not always thinking yourself all the time. Okay? If you are thinking yourself all the time and try to do something all the time, show off sign, show off all the time, you are very easy to get into getting nervous situation. And your performance uh, easy to become a little bit unnatural. It's a pretending stuff. But if you enjoy the silence and the feeling the outside stuff, you will be comfortable in front of the audience and your performance will be more natural because you have a room in your mind. It's a psychological room in your mind. So the point is, don't be afraid of silence. If you use five senses and feel the exter external things, if you concentrate on feeling the opponent or the area around you, that kind of silence is very important when you act. And when you really feel these details, your face expression looks very natural. And you become easy to express your emotion, express your idea, because there, there is a very big room in your psychological heart. Psychologically, you can have a room. And uh, if you take audition, yeah, today my advice is like this. When you start acting, three, two, one, action. Please don't act suddenly. Please give yourself three to five seconds time. Three, two, one, action. One, two, three. Then you do something. If you act drinking something in the audition, everybody start to act. Three, two, one, action. Drink something. But today my advice is like this. Three, two, one, action. One, two, three seconds. And then you slowly you start to dream. Give yourself a time and a room for acting. Or three to an action. Please put out your tap and feel this drink. It is cold, it is hot, and the drink slowly. Feel the taste, smell the drinks, and feel the texture. Okay, please don't be rushed. Yeah, okay. 
this kind of silent time is very important. Silence is one of your acting. So when you take audition, please wait for three to five seconds before you act. Give yourself a time and the room. That's it. Today's theme is don't rush. Okay? Please enjoy the silence. Please feel the external things well and detailed. That's a key point. Please don't always think about myself. Please forget about myself and please put your focus on the other stuff. You, you should really feel from the external stuff. If you make it, you will be very comfortable and uh, you can be very easy to express your feeling, idea and emotion. That's it. Thank you for watching my channel. See you next time. Bye-bye.